Once upon a time, there was a boy named Tich Chu. His parents passed away early so he lived with his grandmother. Every day, she had to work hard to raise Tich Chu. Whenever she had delicious food, she always gave it to her grandson. She hoped that Tich Chu would grow up and mature. However, Tich Chu didn't help his grandmother at all. He just played games all day long. Because of working hard and a poor diet, the grandmother got sick one day. The boy was busy playing with his friends, he didn't know about his grandmother's sickness. One afternoon, the grandma had a fever and she was thirsty. She called Tich Chu for a long time, but she didn't hear him answer. Only when Tich Chu went home to Phi ND food, he was surprised to see that his grandma turned into a bird and flew into the sky. Tich Chu was frightened and called his grandma loudly. Granny, stay with me, please. I'll bring you water. It's too late, my dear. I was too thirsty, so I had to turn into a bird to get some water. I won't be back anymore. Tich Chu ran after his granny in tears. Granny, granny, come back with me, please. I promise I won't make you sad again. He was so regretful that he couldn't stop crying. At that time, a fairy appeared and told the boy. If you want your grandma to turn back into a human, you must take water from the fairy stream for her. But the way to get to the fairy stream is very far. Can you go there? Hearing what the fairy said, Tich Chu was very delighted. He asked for the way to the fairy stream and without hesitating, he started going. The fairy gave Tich Chu a magical herb that could protect him from wild animals. Tich Chu had spent many days and nights on the way to the fairy stream. The boy had to climb up high mountains when it was stormy or go through dark bushy forests with many venomous snakes. Finally, Tich Chu could bring water to his grandma. After drinking the water from the fairy stream, Tich Chu's grandma turned back into the human shape and returned to stay with him. After that, Tich Chu became a lovely and pious kid. He took care of his grandmother with love and didn't play all day long anymore.